fellow journeyman electricians and aspiring electricians, whether you're here to gear up for your electrical exam or just here to sharpen your skill and knowledge, you've come to the right spot. My name is Kane Monroe, and today we're going to dive deep into some challenging questions that will put your whole knowledge to the test. So if you're new here, make sure you hit the like and subscribe button and notification bell so you don't miss any of my new content that's coming out. With that said, let's dive into the exam. All right, guys, let's get started on another journeyman test question video. Um, this is video number eight for you. So let's get going. Um, underground wiring shall not be permitted blank a permanently installed swimming pool unless necessary to supply pool equipment. And the answer is under 260.11b. Where a motor control center operates at a normal voltage to ground of 277 volts, the depth of the working space in the direction of the live parts shall not be less than blank if there are no live or grounded parts on the other side of the working space, 36 inches <clears throat> or three feet. Uh, table 11026A1 condition number one will get you that. Um, the walls, roof, floors of transformer vaults shall be constructed of materials with a minimum fire resistant rating of three hours. And that's in Transformers 450.2 or 450.42. Guys, if you guys are getting something out of this, please reach down there and hit the subscribe button and uh, notification bell so you know when my um, next videos will be coming out. I appreciate it. So... Next question, what is the approximate thickness of insulation of a 10 aug conductor in a type SJ flexible cord? 45 mils, table 400.4. Communication cables shall have a vertical clearance of not less than blank from all points of the roof above which they pass. Eight feet, and that's an 800.44B. So they got to have that vertical, vertical clearance on that roof. What is the minimum total calculated branch circuit load for two show windows that are 20 feet in length? 8,000 VA, NEC 220.14 G2, 2 times 20 is 40 feet times 200 VA is 8,000 VA. Transformers and electronic power supplies of electric signs shall have a secondary cir current circuit rating not more than 300 VA, and that's in 623A. In dwelling units, at least one receptacle, least, let's put an A in there, at least one receptacle outlet shall be installed in bathrooms within blank of the outside edge of the basin, that's 36 inches or 3 feet. 21052D. Guys, make sure you're highlighting all these stuff, all these uh, references in your code book so they're easy to find when you're taking this test. Flat top underfloor raceways are four inches, but not over eight inches wide, with a minimum spacing of one inch between the raceways, shall be covered with concrete to a depth of not less than one inch. 39015B. So they got to have more than an inch of concrete on top of them. A supplemental elect electrode is required where a single ground rod pipe or plate electrode is used for grounding electrode system and the resistance to earth is blank or greater. That's 25 ohms. And it's in 225.53A2 exceptions. All right, guys. Um, thank you for watching. Um, if you guys need some more help, here's a... Here's a private group I have, but thanks for watching and good luck on your test. There you have it, folks. I hope you enjoyed that journey through the electrical exam journeyman questions. Um, if you got anything out of it, or if you have any questions for me or questions about any electrical problems, leave them in a the comment below and I'll get back to you 
Also, if you guys enjoyed this video, please leave me a thumbs up and share this with your fellow electricians to see what type of knowledge they have. Also, hit that subscribe button for me one more time, and I appreciate everything you got. That's all I got today, guys, so be safe out there.